My name is Kaiser Gibbons. This is my presentation on the NBA in-season tournament. So first off, these are like the topics I'm gonna go, I'm going to go through. Um, first is summary of the tournament, second group play, group play draw, knockout rounds, the prizes, and how this will affect the NBA and its pros and cons. So for the summary, the NBA in-season tournament is a new annual competition for all 30 teams that will debut this season. It's already debuted, there's been a couple games so far. All 30 teams will participate, and each team will play one game against each opposing team in their group. Uh, every team will play two games at home and two games away um, from teams in their group as well. And after the, the group stage, the knockout rounds begin. So to differentiate this from normal games, even though it counts as a normal NBA game, they have these different courts. So this is the Timberwolves, this is the Lakers, that's the Suns, and that's the Nuggets. Um, I believe they do this so they, they differ, differentiate um, and make it more like suspenseful in a way. Um, so this is a group play. The league has uh, been divided up by a drawing. Um, and it's not just a random drawing. It's, um, it has to do with like their, um, their record and stuff. So you got like the Mavericks, the Nuggets, the Rockets, the Pelicans, and the Clippers, Grizzly Suns, etc. And you got six of these with five teams each. Um, so this is like um, how they, they make the group. Um, so they have these different pots based on record, um, conference, and they're just randomly selected um, from each of these pots. So pot one, pot two, pot three, and pot four and five. Um, then you get to the knockout rounds after the group play. Uh, which is a single elimination game like a normal tournament um, and the quarter, quarter final will be hosted by two teams with the best record in group play so it's like home court advantage um, the prizes so at the conclusion of the in-season tournament the NBA will name the most valuable player and then the competition will also have an all-tournament team um, and these are the pros and cons um, so the main reason um, I believe they're having this tournament is to get players, all-star players to play more and not to sit out um, because they're hurt or um, just because they just don't want to play. Um, it gives them something to, that motivates them to play, um, play hard. And um, some cons of this could be like uh, more injury because they're playing more often um, and they're not sitting out as much. And yeah, I think it probably wasn't that.